Unfortunate. Very unfortunate, because uh, we're probably gonna die now. Well, we're alive, but at what cost? I'm probably gonna die right now. Okay, I get it. You're very cool with your fucking fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dude, this is dumb. This is really dumb. Like, holy shit. <laughs> Oh my god. It was really good until it isn't. I don't like how brutal stun locking is in this game. Can we sell items to a merchant? Yes, not yet. Okay. Not yet. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, then we'll do this. What? I want to store stuff. How do you store stuff? Uh... Change? This is weird. This is a weird little system they have, but okay. Okay, this is just easier for management. Um, however, what I really wanted to do is use some of these, like, soul things and just, like, you know? Just use all of them. How many souls will that give us? 1200, okay. Um, I, I remember, like, the gargoyles uh, being tough. Like, people tell me, like, not, not people tell me, but, like, I've heard people talk about, like, the gargoyles are, like, a pretty tough first boss. Like, early boss and stuff. Um, but, like, I should have one-shot them, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I absolutely should have. Alright, let's level up. We can get... Um... Like, I would love, like, more endurance, but, like... It's just difficult because I have to do all this stuff to get to them. It just feels slow. Happy you were enjoying the halberd? Yeah, it's really fun. It's really strong, too. I really like that sort of moveset, too. Um, I'm really looking forward to trying the Black Knight halberd. Yeah! Yeah, Zovin, I got the Black Knight Halberd off one of the Black Knights. Which is really lucky. It's also just cool, because I know it's like a chance drop, so I'm pretty hype about using it. I mean, honestly, I know Black, White we Black Knight weapons are going to be amazing. Like, I just know that. I play Dark Souls. Also, they're just like the coolest, you know? Not every boss in Dark Souls through like a million times. And then Dark Souls 1, you first tried a lot of them. Yeah. Not having so much luck with the first trying anything, but oh well. Which is why Sekiro is frustrating. Understandable. Yeah. Well, that's mean. Okay, I get it. You're very cool and good and stuff. Dude, why? Why? Please. I just want to get over there. I don't want to... Ugh. I don't have to deal with all you goobers. Dude. Okay. Alright, staircase OP. Come on, baby. The one that I'm most worried about is Dark Souls 2. <laughs> that game's probably gonna drive me insane. Uh, if you've if you've played Dark Souls, yeah, Ornstein and Smo is what I'm thinking you're talking about. See, all this, the fact that I have to like do all this and be like delicate and dainty and like, oh, just like get a couple hits in here and a couple hits in here and then wait for your stamina to region. Like it's just, it's trying my patience. My patience wants to go hard and fast like Sanic 24 fucking seven. I don't want to deal with this like stamina region and just wah, wah, wah. You know, like, no. I want to throw my forehead at it ASAP. If I die, more forehead.
Get your ass down here. more levels and I, I hate having to say that but it's just I feel that if I had two more strength then we'd be able to wield this weapon one-handed and then I won't have to keep switching and honestly the switching is driving me insane I know it's not even a big deal but it's just like switch for this weapon and this and this like you know used to was opposite for me I feel like the boss were super easy and the areas were hard that's actually what I've heard I've heard that Dark Souls 2 has like the bosses are not a struggle it's just there's 50 billion enemies I'm probably not going to enjoy Dark Souls 2 that much, but I I will like like it for what it is. Just like this game. I really adore this game. It's really I'm really enjoying it. It's also fun to be playing a new FromSoft game, but there's just no way in hell this is going to beat my love for Bloodborne. You know what I mean? I already know that going in. This gave me Bloodborne, you know? DS2 Soul Level 1 never has a sentence scared me more. I beat this on the Switch. Damn, OP gamer. OP gamer. Why are Switch ports always so weird? I've heard that a lot about Switch ports in particular. That was clean. Switch runs games worse than on your cell phone. <laughs> Dude, really? Is that a roast or what? Ugh. All right, let's go for it. Yeah, that's another thing too. I, I, I've said this before, having played a little bit of Dark Souls 2, I feel like it's a good game, but not a good Dark Souls game, if that makes sense. Like, it's just, it's a high standard because of its, its history. I didn't have any stand probably. No, 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 not your fucking combo bullshit. I hate my life. Because you can't run in this game. You're so slow. Everything feels slow as fuck. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be dumb, don't be dumb. It's okay, it's okay. Don't be greedy, don't be greedy. You can't be greedy in this game. It's too slow. It's too slow for greed. It's too slow for greed. Just, no, don't get... What the fuck? You're killing me! How did that miss, though? What the fuck? <laughs> that would have been so mad! Yes! Good this morning! <sighs> Twin humanities, that's what you love to see. Ugh. Ugh, nightmare slain. You say thigh gap OP? <laughs> <laughs> In terms of mechanics and technique, Rap is an excellent streamer. Oh, I she thank mates you. relatively quick bursts of progress, then returns to chat and interacts with people. I hope Aww, she can maintain you. this when she inevitably has 1,000 plus viewers at all times. 
Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you. What the heck? Thank you for the bits and the kind words. It's what the heck? You're trying to. I'm just out here screaming, leave me alone, and you're out here like saying nice things. What the hell? <laughs> Went through his thighs. I just no, I just thought that was really fucking funny, dude. Just like now you see why BB combat is so epic, it's true. Hi Sto! I'm progressing like a baby gamer. Look at me. Chat, are you proud of me? Chat, praise me. Praise me, I'm so good at video games. She's done it. It honestly feels like playing Bloodborne, but like at half speed because I'm just like, okay, I know if I click the dodge button now, I'm going to be in animation. So I'm just going to like try it and hope I get it. And there are times that I click it and just it's like two seconds later, something happens and I'm like, <gasps> you know, like it physically hurts. But I know that I just have to slow me down, you know, you fell off your first player. <laughs> no. Hello, a series of numbers. Thank you so much for that follow. 392. I'm just going to say 392. It's like an area code, dude. <laughs> oh my god, sorry. I just choked on existence. On the joy of existence. You rang the bell? <gasps> Platinum on the way, chat. Oh, we did something? And then, I know we have to ring the bells. There's two bells of awakening. One is up here. On top of the undead church. That's what I was told by the crestfallen. And we did it. We did it. Um, but here's the thing. Is, um... Who the fuck are you? How do I... Hang on. Point up, unneeded. Point down? We already have. We need, um, this. That's how I feel about what he's doing. This is creepy. Who are you? Greetings. I am Oswald of Kareem, the pardoner. The pardoner? Thou art a friend. For thee, a warm welcome. Why are you trying to hug me, dude? To confess, but to accuse. For indeed, all sin is my domain. But I thought that was Velka. Well, what is it? Thou art welcome. Any it is only human to commit a sin. <laughs> Yo, does he laughs like I do? <laughs> you know, we're actually twins. We have so much in common. <laughs> I'm so excited. We have it, dude. We have it at last. I've needed this all my life. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute disrespect. <laughs> it's so rude. Greetings. I am pleased to see you be preserving my humanity. Uh, I don't know about that, dude. Have you seen my face? Um. Purchase item. Reduces curse buildup and breaks curse. It seems very. Oh, look at this. Hang on. Okay. Secret treasure of Arster, the Earl of Kareem. So Kareem seems linked with Velka. It's pretty interesting. Reduces curse. Okay, humans are helpless against curses and can only redirect their influence. The purging stone does not dispel curses, but receives them as a surrogate. The stone itself was once a person or some other being. Wow, get fucked. You got turned to a fucking stone. Get wrecked, dumbass. <laughs> well, what is it? You know? <laughs> I'm so excited. I can't wait to be disrespectful on like every single boss. Just like fucking. I don't need to know how to teabag anymore. There's no need. I'm just gonna fucking go. Well, what is it? The problem is like my my cam is like really zoomed in, so you can't see like my disrespect. I'd just be like, "Yo, what's up?" You know. Absolute rudeness. Slip sold by Bishop of Elka. So he is a Bishop of Elka then. The United player will be added to a list of unfortunate souls who will one day face the wrath of the blaze of the blaze of the fucking dark moon. But I thought the blades of the dark moon were taken up by um, Gwendolyn later in Dark Souls three, and then as a result, Yorshka. But if the blades of the dark moon, they were initially Velka's followers. <laughs> Mm 
Book of the Guilty. The goddess of sin, Valka, oversees this list of the guilty who have disrespected the gods or their covenants and shall one day face... Okay, okay, okay. Right, right. I don't want to be away the way. They're lame, dude. You're not welcome any time. Who is that? <laughs> we actually laughed the same. Let's listen to this again. Hang on, hang on. You're not welcome any Wait for it. It is only shit. <laughs> <laughs> Actually the same. Actually the same, dude. Home, sorry, home boners? No. <laughs> home boners. <laughs> Actually the same, dude. I, I have literally never been human in this game. I'm just letting you know. Humanity is a crutch, so you don't need humanity. Alright, um, so here's the thing. We have, uh, done a thing, but I don't really know what we've done. So what we're gonna do... What we're gonna do, first of all, is we have so many souls! Holy shit, dude! Hang on, I would like to go to Andreas. And I believe Andreas is over here. Hello? Okay, don't shoot me, bro! Rejects humanity, become soulless, mindless being. I want to go to him because we can level, like, a lot, actually. Like, I'm so excited. I've never been happier to get souls in my entire adult life. And then we can be able to carry this weapon and become gods. But also, we could maybe, um, like, wait, what's this? Oh, you can, like, pick a covenant, dude. This is cool. Okay, so. Okay, how many levels can we get? Three. And we're gonna spend two of them right here. We've done it, chat. We've done it! Now I need endurance. But I would like to, like, level up my weapon a little. Also, hi, Specs. I know you've been here. I think I wanted to say hi and then I got distracted. I don't know. I'm just too excited to be here right now. One more. I want this. I want this. It's so pretty and shiny. So we can use three, two Titanite shards to get to plus three, which I feel is a good idea. And we're just gonna go for it. Go get yourself. Oh, he's so nice to me. He cares about me. Can we get another level, or like, are we? Uh, is it like two? We can get one more. So I'd like to get endurance, so we can get slowly more equip load. We're gonna be hitting so much harder. Okay, we're still mid-rolling, which I should have expected, to be honest, but... Um... How much souls does it take to echo? echo uh, how many souls does it take to level up now? Nearly 4k, geez. Let's go take on the Titanite Demon. What's your head armor? It's just a mask. So now, we can one-hand it. Although we do a little stumble. I know, apparently it's like a thing though. That's like me all the time. Oh my god, I just walked into it. Some touch damage shit right here. I don't know if you can take this guy's tail, but he do be having a tail, so I'm gonna try. Wow. Oh, we should have gone back to the other bonfire because then we get plus 10 rather than Andreas's bonfire, but either way. Ow, ow! Okay, like, he just swings! Drive me insane! Come on. You think you're cool with your touch damage? Like I'm playing Hollow Knight out here? I hate it. I hate it. No! I tickled the dodge roll, but I didn't do it! Oh! 
Hang on. Oh, dude, I can't. There's a message. Eh. And pro trick is to not get it. Yeah. You know. It's okay though. We we almost had him. I wonder how many souls he gives us. He's definitely a mini boss. The fact like he's literally positioned in. Oh my god. My souls. That makes me sad. I don't want to lose souls. I've lost so many already. <laughs> I hate this man, dude. Am I- and I wonder- I might have lost humanity too, now I think about it. I don't even know. You're so annoying, you gigantic dingleberry, and you stole everything that I cared about. Which is my money. Because you know we out here getting this money. Demon Titanite. What does that do? Plus five reinforced. Someone from a faceless stone beast known as a Titanite demon. Ah, okay. When the nameless blacksmith's deity passed, from several slabs, great beasts arose. The power of Titanite remains within them, and they still roam Lordron today. Okay. Did I actually know it? <laughs> Fuck, dude. One sec, I'm, I'm just killing this tree in your honor real quick. Yo, the damage though! It's absolutely high IQ. Only for the biggest brain gamers? Yeah, I'm just cosplaying as a big brain gamer to be honest. Whoa, your camo! Dude, I didn't even see your ass, dude. Okay, hang on. I need to do a shout out to Cedric, the homie. Hey. You like that? Wait, what did I? You like the flannel to be cotton down to- hey. Trees, I'm a freaking Canadian, all right? I don't need the flannel is within me. If you cut me open, there's no blood, there's just flannel. I'd be bleeding flannel. Make a man with daddy nose, yeah. That would be really funny though. What is this way? Did I go this way? Was there like lots of tree people? Because I'm not scared of holy fuck, tree people no more. Okay, listen. You and your fucking whip head ass. You think you know whips? You think you know fucking whips? Daddy knows whips. I played the threaded cane, bitch. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. I may have, I may have talked too much shit. <gasps> no! Uh, chat, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Sip, 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 uh, bevy. Quick, quick, real quick. Have a little beer. Grab this. Keep on moving. Get that space. Fuck you. Oh, 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 oh. There's some close calls there. Some close calls there, chat. Woo! Daddy knows even when to die. Sometimes, listen, everyone doubts me. Sometimes there's tactical deaths, okay? All right, all right. All right, chat, don't worry about it. If I die, it's on purpose. Don't worry, it's just really, it's really fucking high IQ. You wouldn't know. What's his shiny? This is tempting me, but here's the problem is I don't trust it because it's tempting me. Hello? Locked by some contraption? You hate to see it. I like the sounds, dude. Calculated on a live vacation. Cl tactical deceasement. I'm actually kind of joking, but kind of not joking because like I absolutely tactically die all the time. You, th you think I don't know that's a fucking thing? Yeah, you, you think I don't know that's a fucking thing? Dude, I've played Zelda. You're not dead? I thought you were dead. Dude, what the fuck? You're supposed to be dead. You have like no health bar. Zelda is is like, you know those enemies that come out of the grand and they're plant people? Just kill me. Yeah, and Durland, you know, I've literally done that so many times. I've been like, let's start it over. I don't like this. I don't like this pull. Let's try it again. 
The first place is going really well, Cedric. I'm having so much fun. And also, I'm slightly losing my mind just a little. Is that it? Did I get all the... Oh, we've done it. We've done it. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Okay. And the boss refuses to do so. I know every single time I ask the boss politely to kill me. So this looks like a boss is the thing. And I would like to not right now. But also, um, we're, we're not going to do that right now because I'm suspicious. That's a very large fog gate. And I'm trying to like not decease. I am pretty exclusively a DS1 challenge runner. Ah, ah. I feel like we've had this conversation, but the problem is... Um, I know I talk about how I have a high IQ all the time, but like I actually don't, and I forget things all the time. Tactically decease yourself? Yeah, okay, so I love this whole area, and it's pretty, and I like the sounds, I like the crickets, and it goes like, phew, phew, phew. <laughs> Ooh. It's really hard to see in this area without your glasses when you need glasses. High IQ is forgetting things. You know what? That's actually my new excuse. Thank you for giving me a new excuse. Is that the excuse is, oh, what's this? Shiny. Oh, I remember this takes me to hell. Yeah, this takes me to hell. Yeah, okay. Um, so here's the thing. I don't really want to to go right now because there there's like some gigantic monster over there. And whoa! Holy shit, dude. It's hard to see. It's really hard to see right now. Mongasteer! Chat, take the wheel. I can't see. Um, so let's see about, uh... Let's see about, like, you know, going in a different direction. I just really want to take out this Titanite Demon, and we have now. Although it kind of sucks, because he took 1,500 of our souls, so that kind of sucks. Um, but I think maybe there's a different direction we can go. I would also like to go back to the bonfire. Um... Because, uh, then we'll, um, I mean, the, we can talk to the Quest Fallen Warrior. I feel like he might have some info for us. He tends to have good info. Yeah, just rest it up real quick. And then, wait, what was up here again? This was, uh, this was... I'm not gonna lie, I normally have a really good memory for maps in this game. Like, FromSoft games in general, I should say. But I'm, like, lost as hell. Um... Okay, let me get my bearings. So we came here. I remember this. I know where this is now. Wasn't there an alternate path that I chose not to take back there? No, there isn't. That area is cleared. What's over here, though? Hang on. This is, uh... I feel like I should be able to see by now. Oh, this is where Onion... Onion Homie was. Okay, so Onion is good. Um, but, like, there's nothing changed over here. So let's just... Yeah, he's good. He's just gonna be like, hmm... Hmm... You know what? Onion, bro? Reminds me very heavily of, uh, Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> oh, and Cedric, I have killed, I just killed Bell Demon. I've killed, um, a Silent Demon and Taurus Demon, which is pretty obvious based on where I am, but, but nothing else really, uh, from what I can remember. Ah, uh, so are we, how do we, why am I so confused? No, we don't go here, we go up. Yeah, I don't know. My mind is just, like, not remembering the map. I know how super, um, interconnected this map is, like, more so than any other. Like, people talk about how this is just, like, genius map design. Um, and I really like it, but right now my brain is just, like, eh. They nearly share a cadence. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what I would say sooner, except you said it much smarter. That was big brain as fuck, accidentally. Dude, we're just one-shotting these boys. Did I pick, like, was the, was the weapon that I picked kind of, like, hard mode, or is it just because I have, like, plus three now? Because, like, I am on fire. Game is pretty open, so you have lots of options. This is true, but I'm also scared of the options that I have available to me for one very- Wait, is this a double elevator? I just realized how this works. This game is amazing. This particular design element is stunning. I always wondered why we didn't have to send the elevator down. It's because there's two. And they balance. And then when- oh. I love this game. I love it. I love it so much. This is so beloved and dear. Asking about the knife? No, no, I'm just like thinking out loud. Okay. 
So. Wait, where's the bonfire? I'm confused. I agree Bloodborne should have those kind of elevators, but then you couldn't get the cool, like, I didn't metal, you, you know? Oh, somebody rang the bell. Wait, was it you? You never give up, do you? I don't know how you do it. Well, it's because I'm a bad bitch. Now? Only one more. But it's going to be suicide. <laughs> Glasses timer ended? Okay, good. Not gonna lie, it's hard to see. Hit him with a well, what is it? Oh, that's a great idea. The fact that Halbert is huge helps a lot, and the fact that we have, like, purple skin and also, like, pink hair is even better. Ooh, what? Well, there are a few ways to go about Collect it bit by bit from corpses. Or you can butter up a cleric and get yourself some. What do you mean, butter up a cleric? And the quickest way, although I never coveting thy neighbor is only human... After all, rap if it's it's an elevator. You're an elevator. <laughs> Loudtrek, I did rescue Loudtrek. Actually, I know he's not a nice man. A purple life, exactly. I'm so actually purple. What are you looking at? Don't try anything. I'm not gonna hurt you. I just want to know what's up. Don't you ever think you'd better unless you enjoy? <laughs> okay, so he's basically like toot man, tutorial man. Oh. <gasps> Shiny man. Very shiny man. I'm sorry that I called you an elevator. <laughs> but what I meant was that you elevate my joy. You know? Chat, you elevate my joy. You're all elevators. You're elevators of joy. Is the thing. Do we tell her what to do here? No. Nice try. <laughs> Hang on. This is how I feel about you, chat, right now. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I feel I feel like this to you. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I feel like this. <laughs> Disrespecting chat. Disrespect. Everyone in chat leaves the point down of friendship. Exactly. I, I do this because I'm really down to hang out, you know? Like, do you want to come over here and hang out, you know? <laughs> Unfollows. Yeah, I'm just defending my chat. I'm about to get... I'm, I'm like, cyberbullying you right now. Point down on us, Vampire Daddy. Exactly! I just want to step on you, you know? I'm kidding, I don't... What is this? That's really suspicious. I don't trust that. My emotions, Monk is dear? Yeah, it's back and forth. You don't know how to feel. That's the thing. That's why you're here, chat. You just want to be confused. Like, what do you want? Like, you, you can't decide what you want, you know? You what? Nothing. I didn't say anything. Ah, hello there. I forgot. It's not It's not next Friday. Next Friday is Step On Me Day. Accept it. What's it going to be? Um, I'm grateful to you for freeing me. That's, like, cool. <laughs> Ooh. Not enough for you. Well... Let's not be greedy now. I don't know what Monka S is. Monka S is just like Pepe looking like very nervous and sweaty. So, like, this is what we get from, like, doing the, the jolly cooperation. This faintly worn medal engraved with the symbol of the sun is the ultimate honor awarded to those who summon the warrior sunlight and complete a goal. The symbol represents Lord Gwyn's firstborn, who lost his deity status and was expunged from the annals. But the old god of war still watches closely over his warriors. Nameless king, baby. Nameless fucking king. Hmm. I keep trying because she's going to say something else. Okay, so we, we can, um, we have to go somewhere else now, but I don't know where we go. And I don't really, like, it's okay, I'll figure it out, Chatterino, so don't, don't be concerned. The problem is, everywhere that I have to go is very scary. Nameless Sui's not the Annals of History. Exactly, that's why he's the Nameless. I have cookies! You wanna know why I reminded myself of where I have cookies? Of why I have cookies? Is because I was about to sass Rancidino, because he's like, I know where, and I was gonna be like, oh yeah, you want a cookie? And then I was like, wait, I want a cookie, and I have a cookie! So, in other words, I, you got saved from my sass by me having a cookie. Thank you. 
Dude, the fucking crow's up here. I'm sorry, who the fuck is snoring? Sauce negated by baked good, true story. Oh, hello. I will teach you miracle. Okay. But you had to explain she didn't sass while sassing in the process. Your axe is in him? Actually it's a halberd? Oh, middle It's a slick workaround? I know, I'm really smart. It's a high IQ I keep talking about. Okay. I'm here for lore is the thing. Great miracle cast by advanced clerics, blah, blah, blah. The Great Heel excerpt borrows from only several verses of Great Heel's result it can only be cast as Stark a few times. Ralph stops stabbing the cleric. No, don't tell me what to do. Would normally link to one's homeland, only the course of the undead has distorted its power, redirecting casters to a bonfire, or perhaps for undead, this serves it as home. This quickly acting miracle inflicts no damage, but propels foes back in defense against arrows. Cleric knights use this miracle when charging into enemy mobs. Guidance facilitates communication between undead, but their value varies greatly. I'm here for lore, exactly. To cast a miracle, the caster learns a tale of the gods and says a prayer to be blessed by its revelations. He lives the shortest of such miraculous tales. Okay. Come again. The effectiveness of the. Like, trying to remember where we can go. Um, I know I'm definitely, like, missing stuff for sure. I don't really want to go to that, like, scary place downstairs. Um, also, I know for sure that there's, like, a way to get up there because there's an item over there. Hang on. I really don't know who was snoring. Yeah, there's an item right over here that I could see for a second, so I know we can get up there somehow. And it's either a clever platforming or something that comes up later. I'm not really sure which. Oh, wait, wait, what's this? Oh, what is this? Yeah, I changed my profile picture. It's about it. That's all I've really done, but... I'm planning on updating a few things slowly. How did I miss this? There was literally this door here the whole time. I like this crow friend. That's the crow that took me here. Why are your seagulls? Okay, very simple little item. Uh, so this looks like we can like kind of hang out with the crow, maybe? 